This is a YAG vitreolysis case using the LX Ultra Q Reflex laser, specifically designed for vitreolysis. Here we are visualizing a large Weiss ring in the middle of the vitreous, and using the coaxial illumination of the laser, we are able to visualize the lens all the way to the retina to give ourselves spatial context. In this case, we see the large Weiss ring in the middle of the vitreous and the retina not being in focus, thus allowing us to feel comfortable firing the laser. Coaxial illumination is key in this case because it does give us that spatial context that we need. Coaxial illumination allows the red reflex and allows the visualization of the retina because the aiming beam, the laser, the illumination tower, as well as the oculars are all on the same optical pathway, thus giving us the needed spatial context for this procedure to be done safely and efficacious. In this case, you also see the floater is being vaporized. It is not being moved away or bounced around. We are mechanically breaking it apart as well as vaporizing because there is a plasma reaction. It's also a non-linear rise in energy as you increase the energy on the laser. Therefore, increasing from 5 to 10 millijoules does not double the amount of dispersion of energy. You also notice the opacity is staying very close to where the plasma energy is being fired, not scattering far away. This is also due to the improved efficiency of this laser using a narrow Gaussian 4 nanosecond pulse. Here we are with less than two minutes, and most of the floater has been dissolved, just a few small remnants remaining, and the patient's almost done and very happy.